Welcome to Google Classroom and today's lesson is how to archive a class. So I'm just going to use this Brave Band class as an example. I'll click here. We will archive it. And so it tells us here that our students won't be able to see or make any changes once we've archived it. I'll click archiving. It lets me know here that the class has been archived. So if I click here now, you'll see as we scroll down, I now have a list of archived classes. If I click on that, it'll show me which class has been archived. Now, if I want to bring that class back, I simply click here and restore. And once I restore this class, it is now back. as an active class. So let's talk a little bit about why we would want to do this. Let's say my Brave Band class here, if I only taught that first semester and second semester I'm not teaching that, I may want to archive this class simply so that, as you'll see here, I have a lot of classes, some that I'm teaching, some that I'm a student in so that this screen doesn't get quite so cluttered. I might want to archive some classes that I only teach one semester, and I can bring those back a second semester when I'm actually teaching them again. That way I'm not recreating all the work, so I've got assignments uh, in there that I'm going to use a second time. They're already done. I don't have to recreate all the work. So that's why we want to archive it, instead of deleting it. So there we go. That's how we archive a class.